Watcher guys, welcome back to the Zeus Daz Unemulated Retro Game Channel. I go by the name of Zeus and we have another shit game time. And this one time we're going to tackle shitty Shanghai shitty karate on the Commodore 64. This is a paid request by Stefano Paracci. Hello mate, thank you very much for your request. And uh, yes, you've picked a pretty good one here as well. So we'll be shit rating this soon and flushing it down the tube of poop into the vault of shitness so once again thank you for your request mate never played this before i know it came around out in an era that was you know we had things like yeah kung fu uh, way of the exploding fist international karate all that kind of stuff so um players decided to throw their hat in the arena in 1988 and produce a shanghai karate it also has a sequel which was programmed by someone else completely and this was created by Mike Brown, Martin Severn, and um, Ian Thompson. Uh, what they did between them with this, I don't know. The graphics, and design, everything is those three dudes. One or two players simultaneous, but uh, we're going to go on easy level. Let's see. We've got no music at all on the title screen, so very good there. Not. It is a budget release, so I think it went for about two ninety nine. So, you know, that's going to take a few points off the ship shitometer obviously if it was a nine pound game then yes that would be uh that would be the need of having the courts thrown at them and the book thrown at them for charging that much for such a game like this but let's get on with it one player mode prepare to fight here you go um and it's uh it literally is um <laughs> it's is digi sounds um, you'll hear these a lot better on the old uh, bread box c64 rather than the uh, updated 6581 chip or vice versa that is but it's <laughs> it, it just sounds like they've sampled shotguns and indiana jones whip because <laughs> it's it's way over the top cartoon I mean, it's like, uh, it's, it, I won't say it's quite, it reminds me of, of, of the early Rocky films, the Rocky, well, Rocky 3 and Rocky 4, as great films as they were, as far as I'm concerned. Um, you watch them, yeah, they do have over-the-top cartoon violence, as far as the sound effects and punches as well. You know, two of those punches, you'd be dead in real life. But this takes it another step further, I think, because that's, look... <laughs> It's, it's shotgun and Indiana Jones. So it's Clint, it's, it's, it's Dirty Harry um, intertwined with Indiana Jones. Oh, come on, can I? You've got to hit them about 58 times before you actually get anywhere on them. Oh, he's killed me. When Lu I mean, we literally exchanged 100 punches there just to just to um get anywhere in it <laughs> just ridiculous so yeah these are sample digi sounds no doubt about that as i said you'll hear them better in the um in the older uh sound chip than you will in the in the new sid chips but yet yeah, uh, <laughs> oh it's ridiculous though you can't you're kind of hoping and you know you're you're just wishing for the for the best that you'll get somewhere in it just taking your luck i mean i'm, I'm just i'm just chancing my luck here i don't really know i know what moves i'm doing but i'm whether they connect is another another thing altogether so would I be happy paying two ninety nine and getting him playing this? As I said, it's not it's not as if I was paying eight pounds for it. Look at this, I've got to hit him about eighty fucking times before anything happens. And so oh that was a super move, wasn't it? How did I jump that far? Wow. 
Come on, I'm going to beat you this round. Come on. Yeah, my round, thank you. I don't know how many levels there are. So three kicks in the box there. Eh? And I'm just, see look, I'm just doing that now. And um, I'm doing a similar move what you would do in Dragon Ninja on the Commodore 64 to complete that. Just a literally up and down kick. Oh, he's starting to get some bleed. Oh, hang on, come on, play the game, mate. What are you doing? Oh, it's... I'm just hoping, I really don't know what... If... It's just a pure luck, that's all it is. There's no actual skin involved. Wee! i got superpowers, where are you going? I'm over here. And three more kicks in the bollocks. No. Go on. There you go, I've got him, have I done that? Player two loses a what? Oh, player loses, so I've got to, oh, I've got to play this like eight times. So you've got to knock him out about five times. Hit him about 50 times. So you're looking at about 300 to 400 connections to win the entire fight. I'm just, do look, I'm just chipping away. Oh, he's taking more energy off me. I swear he is. Come on. Oh, this is anybody's round. Oh, I swear he's taking more energy off me. I mean, his connections are hitting heavier than mine. Come on. Yay, God. So I've got to knock him out one more time now. I'm just intrigued to see if there's any other levels. Nice combo there. Oh, it's ridiculous. <laughs> it's like the old Bruce Lee films. I mean, the old ones. The ones that was in it, like uh, Fist of Fury, if you ever see that. Heavily dubbed with ridiculous sound effects for the, for the punch and kicks. Go and check that out. Fist of Fury, boy, with Bruce Lee in it. <laughs> I'm slaughtering him in this one, aren't I? Oh, no, I what's going on? Am I be yeah, of course I'm beating him. Yay, is that me now? Am I, is, that the, is that the round one now? I win it. So what happens now? Oh, we do get a different background. Okay, all right. Well, that's another point. Ooh, 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 ooh. So I've got to punch. <laughs> We're not taking any notice of each other. He's looking the other way. That's kick. That's sweep. That's high kick. That's a punch up. Are you just going to go that way? Because I don't... All right. Punch, punch. Come here. There's a, a Chinese proverb. He who runs away is the bigger man. There's also another saying. Where two ninety-nine pound games. Beware, they are often shit. Uh, right, come on. Unless you play Zybex on the Atari a bit. That's fantastic for a, for a 299 game. Come on. Come here, stop running away. I, the thing is, this game, it's, um, there's no music. It's, uh, it's, you're just trying to make connection. It's not the easiest thing to do, especially when they're running away like that. What are you doing? You're doing Yaa Kung Fu moves. Why are you jumping away like that all the time? I'll just get you in the corner and kick you in the head. Look, I'll just do that. Look, look, we go. look at my, look at his energy. Look how little that goes down. I'm having to kick him one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine. Look at that combination. Thirty-nine, and that didn't include the beginning of my energy. So you're looking at about seventy hits to take a round off them. 
and then you've got to go like possible seven rounds. That's just fucking ridiculous. That's boring. That is. And this character's an idiot because he just keeps running away. There's a little punch, a little high arc. What do you keep doing that for? I mean, two ninety nine, yeah, but what was that in 1988? You're probably looking at about six quid now, aren't you? Seven quid, maybe. Was it really worth that much? Two ninety nine back then? Was it really around seven pound back then? I remember buying two pound ninety nine games, and I don't remember fee it felt feeling as if it was seven pound out of my wallet, like it would now. If I took seven pound out of my wallet, that would hurt. So uh, inflation prices, maybe they're not as um, devastating as we think they are. But regardless, there's no music in this. You 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 don't know if they're. If you're actually, well, you do know if you're connecting, but you don't know if you're deservingly connected because you're just hoping for the best. And um, the sound effects is ridiculous. So you've either got Clint Eastwood's Magnum 44 shotgun noise. Uh, yeah, or Indiana Jones' bloody whip. That's punch, so you punch, punch, or sort of like a halt. He's not really punching, he's more like he's holding his arm out already, he's just straightening his arm. Where are you going now? You know what? I don't want to play this anymore because it's boring. You, you, you just, no, fuck it. Um, it's just, you don't, <laughs> sound effects are stupid. Um, you're required to hit them too many times. You've got to hit them about 70 times before you take a round off them. And that's just the first round. So the minimum is somewhat like three or four. So you're looking at 280, roughly 300 hits before you can even win a fight, at least. And if you go the maximum seven rounds or whatever it is, you're looking at a thousand connections between you. That's ridiculous. It's like all the kicks and moves, the heavy heavy. uh, Handed moves is more equivalent of just a little uh, finger poke. Uh, that's yeah, it's crap. I mean, it's laugh for one round. It might be, it might be more fun with two player. Everything's more fun with two player. Um, but for a one player game against a CPU, it's boring. It's crap. You'll get fed up with it. I mean, I already, I've just got fed up with it now. I don't feel like wanting to play it anymore. That's it. That's done for me. I feel like I've seen the whole game. Even though there's probably different backgrounds, I've seen the entire game. That's enough for me. And even for two ninety nine, I'd still be disappointed. Um, if it had a six pound price tag on it, oh my word! So um, let's get on with it now. What are we going to give this? Um, as I said, no music. Uh, sound effects as laughable, severe cartoon violent sounds. Um, as you can hear, <laughs> that's ridiculous. Um, the, the characters move smooth enough but and, and they react quite quickly when you pull the moves off but whether you connect with them or he connects with you first is another thing it's just guesswork and we look at my energy bar look how slowly it's going down and he's whacking the hell out of me ridiculous um, yeah the balance of, of energy is, is piss poor program that uh, is very unbalanced I mean, it's balanced on both sides. Both players take the little amount off, but you need to take more energy off. That's stupid. I mean, it should take no more than, say, 15 hits, not 70. That's just fucking ridiculous. So, uh, yeah, that's a bit of a piss-poor part of the game, that. So, um, yes, I don't know much about player software, what, what releases they've done. I've probably played quite a few games, but off the top of my head, I can't think what ones they've done. But what we're going to do this, Stefano, what are we going to give this? What are we going to rate this? What are we going to do? We're definitely going to flush it like the beginning of this video, right down the tube, right down the fucking toilet into the vault of shitness, that's for sure. Even for $2.99. You wouldn't, once you get past the first background, a few rounds, you wouldn't play again. Um, as I said, it might bring more fun in two-player mode, but not not um, not one player. It's crap. So um, what are we going to give it? Uh, it's definitely shit anyway, isn't it? Let's have a look. Uh, H H H I T. It's shit. That's all there is to it. Um, and that was easy level. 
ridiculous. Um, okay, I'm going to give it a uh, one of those uh, sessions where you do lots of poo nugget, poo farty shits. <laughs> I'm going to give that, I'm going to give that 77 shits, strictly because it is a budget title as well. And it might bring you more fun with two player mode, but in one player, you won't get further than the second background before you get bored. There's no point. It feels very empty. It's dull. It's, it's, it's crap. It's, it's play once, play twice, put it away. Never play it again. The software, that's, that's what it is, in my opinion. All right, there you go. That's it for this edition of Shit Game Time. A pop-up, or shall I say four pop-ups will follow shortly. Four random other Shit Game Time reviews, check them out. And the other one will be a video where you can place your requests. So if there is a game that has tormented you in your past or you really hate or you would love to see flush down the fucking toilet officially into the vault of shitness and a middle finger up to the programmers and the publishers that, that produced the game, then go to that video, listen carefully, and place your requests there. And uh, Zeus will do your doing. They do a big doo-doo for you in the toilet for it. All right, until next time, thanks again for joining me on this edition of Shit Game Time. Until next time, make sure you come back to the channel. Subscribe if you haven't. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Take care, everyone. Zeus, out of Plopsville. <laughs>